Honda Ski and Outdoor Sport, Deemer's Glass, Beeler Orthodontics, Summit Regional Medical Center, Octopus Car Wash, Mountain Mobile Auto Glass, and Little Blue Bird Studios. And now, Cholo Ford presents High School Basketball on iTalk 1067 and worldwide on iTalk1067.com. Welcome to Blue Ridge High School here for this matchup between Yuma Catholic and Ash Fork. Score right now 7 0. Yuma Catholic over Ash Fork. Welcome to the broadcast. This is Shola Ford's presentation of high school basketball right here on iTalk1067.com. I'm Brandon Todd, Mike Side, Weston Hall. How are we doing, guys? Happy New Year, big guy. Thank you, you too, man. Yuma Catholic here out to a 7 0 lead early in the first period. They have possession of the ball. Doing a good job finding the open man. Three pointer, money in the bank. That's number 11, Delgado, with this second three pointer of the first period. That's 10 great ball to movement. nothing is your score. Great ball movement by Yuma, honestly. That law pass is hard to get, but able to connect to get the three. We're going to have a foul here. It's going to be an offensive foul, illegal screen on number 15 from Ash Fork. Ash Fork only with seven players on their roster. That's crazy. It's always tough. Better that be cheap. Be tough. <laughs> It could be tough at the same time. It could be a benefit. I don't know. I don't know basketball that well. Usually teams with low guys are usually really good in shape. So <laughs> Here we go, 10-0. Yuma Catholic with the ball and the lead. Find up a man in the corner, three-pointer. That's off the iron. Rebound down to Ash Fork. Number 34 at the rebound. That is uh, Iola. And Keel for Ash Fork will bring the ball across the time stripe. Over to Iola on the right elbow-ish. Pick up his dribble well beyond the three-point stripe and trying to get a pass deflected. It'll stay Ash Fork ball. Checking into the game number 25 for Ash Fork. That is Martinez. He'll replace Iola. No injuries to report here. That is your Summit Healthcare Regional Medical Center injury report. Summit Healthcare Regional Medical Center has everything your athlete needs to get back in the game. Summit Healthcare Regional Medical Center. Ash Fork on the low block. Gets double teamed. Tries to find a cutter. And that ball is batted out of bounds. It'll remain Ash Fork ball. 4-17 remaining here in the four, first period. 10 to zilch. Your score, Yuma Catholic over Ash Fork. Inbound. And that's going to be a, uh, ooh, almost a turnover. Nice play there by number 14 for Yuma Catholic. Malone, Mullen, Mullen. <laughs> One of those three names is correct. I probably, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Ash Fork for a deep three, top of the key. That's short. Rebound down to Yuma Catholic. They're going to push the ball up quickly. They find the open man number one. That's Hunt. Hunt, good feed. Offensive board, no. Shot won't go. Ash Fork with the ball. 3.50 remaining here in the first period. And we're going to get a body foul right there on number 11, Delgado. Six points for Delgado. He leads all scorers as of now. I only have three, six. I only have eight points on my board on my book here but they've scored 10. Somehow I missed two points somewhere, Weston. Yeah, and honestly, I didn't You're supposed you to be my second pair you. of eyes. I'm sorry. Remains Ash Fork ball. <laughs> Inbounding is number 12, Beeson. They get the ball in and they will throw it out to Keel, who will dribble to set up the offense. Top of the key, right-handed dribble. Switches back, left-handed drive. He'll step out, a little one-footed step back three-pointer that gets blocked. By number 30, Not a high percentage block. shot. Corner four, three, short. Couldn't connect. And the ball will be out of bounds. It'll, it'll remain the McCatholic ball. New McCatholic's a big tall team. Very. Four, three from the corner. <laughs> number four with the deep ball. That's Poo. Is that correct? Poe. Correction, it's Poe, not Poo. <laughs> that makes a lot more sense. Ash Fork gets on the board. Number 25, that's uh, Martinez. Yuma Catholic with a little 15 footer, got it. Beautiful shot, great ball movement on Yuma. That's Erath. Earth. <laughs> Two point. <laughs> I'm turning these names. I apologize to the families. We're going to get a reach-in foul here on Yuma Catholic. 15-2 is your score. Weston, we let that gentleman know it's Poe. Actually, it doesn't matter. No, man. That's fine. 
when I wrote it down, I was like, who doesn't seem correct? You know, you never know. Some people have interesting names. Two to 223 remaining here in the first period. Your score 15, you McCatholic 2 to Ashford. Ashford to inbound. And it'll go into Keel. Keel dribbles it off the defender's foot. Race for the ball. And uh, on the floor is Keel. It'll be a turnover. Find the open man. Don't get. Oh. Oh. He wanted that he, dunk. He was going for it. He wanted it. Yes, he did. We're gonna, she's shooting two, number 23. That's uh, Earth. I highly doubt his name is pronounced Earth, E-R-A-T-H, but I'm going to say Earth. 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 Let's just go with Earth. No, not Earth. 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 All right, Earth. there we go. His first of two is up and gets the shooter's roll. Count it. Is that what they call it, a shooter's roll? Yes. I thought so. See, you know a lot more than you think. That's a decent basketball player. Want to hear a funny story about me playing basketball? I'd love to. Earth, second shot is in. He makes both. Sophomore year, I was on varsity. Nope, junior year I was on varsity, junior. And that wasn't, our, our, my junior year in basketball, we had a really good senior class. Ashford now finds uh, 34, that is uh, Iola, bottom of the block, passes back up to Keel. Three-pointer no good, rebound down to uh, Yuma Catholic. Nice ball movement. Baseline drive out to the uh, elbow, three-pointers long, rebound down to uh, Ashford, it'll be Ash Fork ball, we have a loose ball foul here on number 10. So I was like one of those guys who 30 seconds left in the game, Todd, get in, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> well, like, first period, my name gets called by the coach. Okay. Todd. I'm like, yeah, coach. He goes, give me some water. <laughs> oh, I gotta love that when that happens. No, you don't have to love that. <laughs> Ash Fork here at the ball, that's Keel. <laughs> Setting up the offense. Good pass down low to Iola. Over to Martinez. And we're going to have a uh, foul's going to be on number 10 from Human Catholic. That's a couple on him. That's Logan. He's going to have to. Next table, boss. Next table, boss. <laughs> <laughs> Sub coming in. Oh, definitely a foul for sure. Ashford to inbound, trailing 17 to 2. 118 remaining here in the first period. Pretty sure I saw two double dribbles just now. Yes, you did. <laughs> <laughs> Turnover by Ashford. Here comes Jimmy Catholic on the fast break. Rebound won't go. We're going to have a shooting foul. Going to the uh, Mount Mobile Autoglass free throw line is going to be number four. Oh. oh. And you can see the foul right there on number 24 from Ashford. Keel. Shooting two is O. Oh. Corrected from. Yeah. First one is up and in. That's that his fourth, amazing. fourth point on the contest. Three, six, nine, 11, 12, 14, 15, 16. I missed two points somewhere. I don't know where they went. Somewhere I missed two points. 102 remaining here in the first period. 18 to two is your score. Poe makes both of them. Kind of disappointed his aim, isn't it? I know, right? That would have been great. Been a lot more fun to say. Ashford here brings the ball across the time stripe, and we're going to have a foul. A hand check foul. Pretty touch foul there with the score being 19 to 2. I don't understand why we're even calling that foul, but it's a foul nonetheless. Ashford to inbound. And inbound is going to be, oh, my fault, dang it. It's going to be New Catholic ball turnover on the inbound. Ball comes into Pervious. The dish out over the elbow, that's Conley. Conley finds the corner, that's Poe. Poe to the low block, nice. Great ball movement, great shot, number 23, Aerith. It's our boy Aerith. Aerith. 21 to two is your score, 33 seconds remaining here in the first period. Three pointer is <laughs> just off, just short. Coming back, Unicathic with the ball. And they have a great job finding the open man. Through the wickets of Earth. And on the fast break, the ball's poked away. It'll remain Ash Fork ball. Ten seconds remaining here in the first period. 21 to 2 is your score. This is North and Pioneer College tip off. This is the first quarter. When it comes time to tip off your college education, choose the school to low tuition in Arizona, North and Pioneer College. On the fast break for Yuma Catholic, Poe up and in off the glass. And that'll do it for first period of your score.
Your score ending the first period 23, Yuma Catholic 2 for Ashford. We'll step away to show the force presentation of high school basketball right here on italk107.com. Don't take time out of your busy day. Let Mountain Mobile Auto Glass come to you. All our technicians are certified by the National Auto Glass Safety Council. Mountain Mobile Auto Glass will give you $50 cash, free movie passes, and free Just dinner. 536-597-2 Mountain Mobile Auto Glass Cash Back to You. After one period here at Blue Ridge High School, the Yuma Catholic Shamrocks lead the Ash Fork Spartans 23 to deuce. Scoring looks like this. Hunt for Yuma Catholic, two points. Con nope, Poe with seven, leading the scoring. Delgado with six. Earth with six. And Perez with two. For Ash Fork, Martinez, the lone jumper. <laughs> two points for Ash Fork. Ash Fork will inbound. They'll control possession here in the start of the second period. This is the Northland Pioneer College start of the second quarter. Weston, what are the ace hardware keys for Ashford to get back into this game, being down 21 points after the first quarter? You know, honestly, Ashford needs to take better care of the ball when they're on offense. They seem to have a lot of turnovers that are really honestly putting them behind, and that's really it. Yeah, definitely not the cleanest play of basketball we've seen. At all. That was, uh, that was a decent ball movement there, finding the big man down low. He gets fouled on the shot. Martinez will go to the... Mountain Mobile Autoglass free throw. Nope, excuse me. No, I thought he said two shots. Maybe not. No, he didn't. He Ash Fork will inbound. He was on the floor? Yeah. For three. Short. Rebound down to Yuma Catholic. Up ahead. Nice pass. Three at Poe. With a reverse layup. Nice job on Yuma Catholic. That was pretty. That was a great pass. Poe, that's his ninth point of the game. Next table, bud. Hey, boss, next table. We're located here right next to the scorer's table. When the Yuma Catholic guys come to sub in, they sub in at our table. <laughs> but it's actually the other table that they need to go to. You know, stoppage in action here somehow. 25 to 2. Did I miss any points? I don't think I oh, no, no, you didn't. Yuma Catholic with the ball, bringing it up as number one. That's Hunt. Top of the key, they'll find number 30, Pervious. Pervious on the elbow, one dribble, cross-court pass. Shot is up, three-pointer, money in the bank. That was a beautiful shot by number one. Honestly, Yuma just passing the ball well, finding the open man. Fifth point for Hunt. 28 to two is your score here. 641 remaining here in the second period. Ashford controls possession on the elbow. Driving baseline, we're gonna have a loose ball foul. Foul's going to be on number 21, White, Stanley. That puts, got a replay here of the previous three-pointer from Hunt, nothing but the bottom of the net. That'll put uh, the Yuma Catholic over the foul limit, one and one here for Martinez. His first Mount Lobato glass free throw is nothing but the bottom of the net. His third point, he uh, leads Ashfork with scoring with all three of their points. Let's see if he can convert the second, and it's good too. He makes both, makes both Mountain Mobile Autoglass free throws. And Yuma Catholic brings the ball up quickly. Baseline drive, back out to the elbow. Thought about the three-pointer. Decided to drive off the glass, no good. Battle for the rebound, it goes, comes down to Ashford. And that's Gill with the rebound. Ayola handling the ball now. He picks up his dribble. Almost turns the ball over. And they almost turn the ball over again. And then they almost turn the ball over again. And then they do turn the ball. Nope, almost, yep. Uh, Battle, yeah. we're gonna have a jump ball. <laughs> I didn't say any actual words in the last 20 nope, seconds. You did. You see the battle for the ball there. And uh, the score is 28 to four. Hey, D3, D3. Yuma Catholic over Ash Fork. Ash Fork looking for the open man, cross court pass to Hunt. Hunt thought about three pointers, decided against it. Back up to the top of the key to Pervious. Pervious to the elbow. Baseline drive, floater, nice, nice touch. That's for 20, his first points of the game. That's Stover. See the replay here. Right-handed baseline drive, little 
eight foot floater. Nice touch. How much you can do on the defensive end on that one. Ashford tried the give and go, almost turned the ball over. They retained possession. This is Keel with the drive. Back out to three point. Over to Martinez for three off the glass. No good. Follows his own shot, gets his own rebound. Putback won't go. Rebound comes down to Yuma Catholic. Number deuce one, Stanley. Yeah, Yuma Catholic has some size, don't they? Yes, That's they do. You were yeah. saying before we started the game, Yuma Catholic's a good school. Absolutely, they are. Have you seen them play yet? Uh, I've, I've only seen film of them and from previous years. They work well together. And yeah, they certainly move the ball well. Their height gives them such an advantage to be able to make passes up above the defender's hands. We're going to have a loose ball foul here. Black, black 24, that's going to be on Keel. That's only the fourth foul on Ash Fork. A couple guys will check into the game here. Number three, Miller, and I didn't catch the other guy. This is Shola Ford's presentation of high school basketball right here on italk1067.com. 21. 21 at Stanley. His first point to the contest. Brings the score 32 to 4. Yuma Catholic over Ashford. Ashford with the drive. And loose ball. We're going to have a travel. Ace Hardware, 24-7 locksmith. Next time you're locked out of your car, or maybe you just need a key replaced any hour of the day, give, D give uh, Ace Hardware a call. They're a helpful place with three locations, Pine Top, Overguard, and right here in Cholo. It's really quiet in here. Yuma Catholic has the ball. Back to the top of the key. And uh, tried to feed the big guy at the free throw line. Wasn't expecting the pass in and out of his hands. That's a turnover for Yuma Catholic. Bringing up the ball is Iola. Iola looking for an open man. He'll give it up to Vasquez. Vasquez loses the dribble off his foot, and that'll be a turnover of Yuma Catholic ball. And 24 for Yuma Catholic. That's Perez. He'll come back into the game. Taking a seat is Stover. Stover exits the game with two points on the contest. Yuma Catholic now cross court pass to the corner, putting up the three ball. Off the back, or excuse me, off the rim, then off the back, but offensive rebound, put back, won't go. And the rebound comes down to Ashford. And Ashford will turn the ball over and underneath the hoop, and we're going to have a foul here on the shot. Going to the line is going to be number one, Hunt. He'll shoot two Mountain Mobile Auto Glass free throws. Ashford just not been able to gather themselves on the offensive end and make something happen here. Oh, apparently that was not a shooting foul. That's surprising. New Catholic to inbound. They get the ball in. Cross court pass to the elbow. Thought about three. Nope. Tried to the middle. Floater. Off the glass and in. Nice touch. Number 10. Diaz. Number 10. That's Logan. His first points of the contest. 34 to 4. Your score now. Ash fork for three. That's just off the back of the iron. Rebound down to Yuma Catholic. And they push the ball up quickly to the corner. Drive off the glass. Is that, was that shot good? Yes, it was. It was good by who? Number, that was number 11. There's no 11 out there, big guy. Yeah, it's right there. Ash Fork, air ball. Number 11, that's Delgado. His first points to the contest. Two McCaffrey pushing the ball quickly. Nice dish, finding the open man, the cutter. Number 21, up and in. That's Stanley. You get replay here. You see that pass. Catch and shoot. A great 38 break. to 4. You score here. Ash Fork with the ball. Again, Ashford with only seven men on their roster. Impressive. That'd be tiring for them. Absolutely. 38 to 4, 222 remaining here in the first period. Where is Ashford, do you know? I'm going to be honest with you, I don't. That rebound's no good. Actually, it didn't touch any iron, so they had to stop play. Dead ball. Did you say you knew where they were? I don't. I believe it's down south somewhere, kind of by Tucson, but I don't. Yuma, good ball movement, trying to find the open man. Passing it around the perimeter, driving in. And that, we're going to have a shooting foul now. 32, Grover, he'll go to the Mountain Mobile Auto Glass free throw line. Foul's going to be on number 15, Iola. Super quiet in here. Very quiet. Kind of makes me embarrassed to talk loud. <laughs> Ashfork is out there by... Um, Flagstaff. First Mountain Mobile Autoglass free throw, no good by uh, 
Grover. That was, could have been his first points of the game. No good. <laughs> his second Mount Mobile Argos free throw is off, in and out. And we're going to have a, uh, a foul on Ash Fork. It'll remain near Catholic ball. And that puts uh, that puts Jimmy Catholic back to the Mountain Mobile Glass free throw line. Delgado at the line right now. His first shot is up and good. His first one of the one and one. Delgado makes them both. Forty to four, your score now. Jimmy Catholic over Ash Fork. That shot's going to be blocked. Battle for the ball. It's going to be a foul down low. It's going to be on white number 10, which is Logan. Number three checking in for Yuma Catholic. That's Conley. Taking a seat is Logan. At the Mount Movadagas free throw line is number 15. Iola, he fails to hit the rim, so it's another dead ball. And Yuma Catholic will inbound. Man, great ball movement here by the Yuma Catholic Shamrocks. Cross court pass back to Mullen into the corner. Under the low block, back out to Mullen. Mullen gets his pass reflected and almost turnover. What are we going to have here? We're going to have. Uh, we're going to have an offensive foul on number 24 with the hook. <laughs> can do the hook. I'm sure you can't. Weston, you shouldn't talk so much. You know, I'm trying. It's very difficult, though. Very difficult, especially being who I am. 40 to 4 is your score. 1 14 remaining here in the first period. Ash Fork with the ball. Looking, looking for an open man. Finds one. Cross court pass to Iola. Iola driving. It's a shot up off the glass. No good. Battle for the rebound, it will. Ashford with the ball, nice job by Ola. Good hustle by him, diving on the floor, getting the ball, calling timeout. We'll take one with them. This is Shuttle Board's presentation of high school basketball right here on itop167.com. Who sells the number one truck in America? Sholo Ford. That's right, not only do they sell it, Sholo Ford is that plus to buy it. Why? Guy Hatch guarantees it. In fact, he guarantees you'll get the best deal on your next Ford car, van, or SUV as well. It doesn't matter what you buy. Sholo Ford has the best deal. Sholo Ford on the east end of the Deuce and at SholoFord.com. 40 to 4 is your score. Yuma Catholic over Ash Fork. 55 seconds remaining in the first half. Ash Fork to inbound. They'll get it down to the low block and uh, shot won't go. Yuma Catholic pushes it ahead. This is Mullen. His layup up and in. I was hoping he was going to dunk it. I thought he was going to go for it. I would have if I were him. <laughs> This first two points of the game. Up and down the lineup, everybody's okay. been contributing here for Yuma Catholic. 36 seconds remaining. Almost a turnover there. Nice hustle. Ashfork remains possession, retains possession, excuse me. Iola dribbling way out beyond the three-point line, almost near half court. He'll give it up to Vasquez. Shot won't go. Rebound down to Yuma Catholic. 19 seconds remaining in the half. Ashfork just can't make anything happen on the offensive side. Conley pushes the ball up. Now they'll find Mullen, top of the key. Back over, three-pointer, down it. Yes, sir. Beautiful shot in the 24 and Yuma Catholic. That's Perez. You can see the repeat, replay here. Wide open shot. Lick it and stick it. That won't go. Hey, that'll end the half at 45 to 4. Yuma Catholic over Ash Fork. We'll step away for halftime. This is Shola Ford's presentation of high school basketball right here. Orthodontist Dr. Joshua Beeler has been providing family-friendly orthodontics in Sholo and the entire White Mountains since 2006. If you need braces, stop in and see the friendly folks at Beeler Orthodontics and meet their professional staff. Dr. Beeler and his team have the latest in orthodontics technology, and they work with each patient individually to custom tailor the most effective treatment plan for the best results. Beeler Orthodontics is a proud sponsor of high school sports. Beeler Orthodontics, live to smile, love your smile.
When you think glass, think Deemer's Glass in Lakeside. Deemer's Glass offers the best selection of quality glass with affordable prices. They do full home window packages, replacement windows, custom shower doors and enclosures, custom mirrors in many shapes, styles, and colors, glass doors and hardware, commercial glass for buildings and offices, skylights, screens, fire-rated glass for your fireplace or stove, window film, and more. Visit Deemer's Glass today on Porter Mountain Road in Lakeside or call 1-888-GLASSMAN. I got this. Don't take time out of your busy day. Let Mountain Mobile Auto Glass come to you. All our technicians are certified by the National Auto Glass Safety Council. Mountain Mobile Auto Glass will give you $50 cash, free movie passes, and free Just dinner. 536-597-2 Mountain Mobile Auto Glass Cash Back to You. I chose Northland Pioneer College because it's close to where I live. My instructor taught me how to build a foundation and framing and use different tools that I haven't used. There's always new work everywhere. I want to get educated and start from the bottom and learn how to find myself and what I can do. MPC is transforming my life. I chose MPC because it offers good quality and education. Ultimately, I want to be a nurse anesthetist. This is the start to that path. The instructor want you to succeed, which is really helpful. I've learned a lot so far in just one semester. It's kind of crazy how much I've learned. Northern Pioneer College is transforming my life by helping me achieve my goals in my career. At Summit Healthcare, you'll find a level of care you might not expect from a rural hospital. We've recently received five stars from CMS, a prestigious ranking that less than 5% of facilities in Arizona earn. Our cancer center has proven its level of advanced care with a national accreditation from the Commission on Cancer. And we continue to add more doctors and services so that you don't have to leave the mountain to find the care you need. At Summit Healthcare, we're elevating care here at home. You've been there waiting forever at the gas station for the guy to free up so he can fill up your propane tank. Or worse, the only qualified propane technician decided to stay home that day. Yep, you've been there and I have too. That's why now I get my propane from Ace Hardware every time. You get Ace Hardware's world-famous customer service when you stop in for propane. That's right, you get in, you get out, and you get a great deal on propane and everything else. From Ace Hardware at their locations in Pine Top and Heber. Ace Hardware is proud to support White Mountain Sports. Who sells the number one truck in America? Sholo Ford. That's right, not only do they sell it, Sholo Ford is the best place to buy it. Why? Guy Hatch guarantees it. In fact, he guarantees you'll get the best deal on your next Ford car, van, or SUV as well. It doesn't matter what you buy. Sholo Ford has the best deal. Sholo Ford on the east end of the deuce and at SholoFord.com. Orthodontist Dr. Joshua Beeler has been providing family-friendly orthodontics in Sholo and the entire White Mountains since 2006. If you need braces, stop in and see the friendly folks at Beeler Orthodontics and meet their professional staff. Dr. Beeler and his team have the latest in orthodontics technology, and they work with each patient individually to custom tailor the most effective treatment plan for the best results. Beeler Orthodontics is a proud sponsor of high school sports. Beeler Orthodontics, live to smile, love your smile. When you think glass, think Deemer's Glass in Lakeside. Deemer's Glass offers the best selection of quality glass with affordable prices. They do full home window packages, replacement windows, custom shower doors and enclosures, custom mirrors in many shapes, styles, and colors, glass doors and hardware, commercial glass for buildings and offices, skylights, screens, fire-rated glass for your fireplace or stove, window film, and more. Visit Deemer's Glass today on Porter Mountain Road in Lakeside or call 1-888-GLASSMAN. I got this. Don't take time out of your busy day. Let Mount Mobile Auto Glass come to you. All our technicians are certified by the National Auto Glass Safety Council. Mount Mobile Auto Glass will give you $50 cash, free movie passes, and free Just dinner. 536-597-2 Mountain Mobile Auto Glass Cash Back to You. I chose Northland Pioneer College because it's close to where I live. My instructor taught me how to build a foundation and framing and use different tools that I haven't used. There's always new work everywhere. I want to get educated and start from the bottom and learn how to find myself and what I can do. MPC is transforming my life. I chose MPC because it offers good quality education. 
ultimately, I want to be a nurse anesthetist, which is the start to that path. And instructors want you to succeed, which is really helpful. I've learned a lot so far in just one semester. It's kind of crazy how much I've learned. Northern Pioneer College is transforming my life by helping me achieve my goals in my career. At Summit Healthcare, you'll find a level of care you might not expect from a rural hospital. We've recently received five stars from CMS, a prestigious ranking that less than 5% of facilities in Arizona earned. Our cancer center has proven its level of advanced care with a national accreditation from the Commission on Cancer. And we continue to add more doctors and services so that you don't have to leave the mountain to find the care you need. At Summit Healthcare, we're elevating care here at home. You've been there waiting forever at the gas station for the guy free up so he could fill up your propane tank. Or worse, when the only qualified propane technician decided to stay home that day. Yep, you've been there and I have too. That's why now I get my propane from Ace Hardware every time. You get Ace Hardware's world-famous customer service when you stop in for propane. That's right, you get in, you get out, and you get a great deal on propane and everything else. From Ace Hardware, their locations in Pine Top and Heber. Ace Hardware is proud to support White Mountain Sports. Welcome back. We are at halftime here in Blue Ridge High School. The score, 45, Puma Catholic, 4, Crash 4. Let me give you the uh, rundown on the scoring. Hunt, first for Puma Catholic, Hunt with 5 points. Poe with 9. He's tied for the leading scorer with Elgato, who also had 9. Logan with 2. Mullen with 2. Stover with 2. Stanley with 4. Aerith with 6. Perez with 5. That's 45. And then the only person to have scored for Crash 4 is Martinez. Let's talk about um, our potential Honda Skin Outdoor Sport player of the game so far. I would say it's a tie between the two leading scorers between Poe and Delgado. We'll see which one of them decides to break out in the second half. To claim our player, our Honda Skin Outdoor Sport player of the game, the Honda Skin Outdoor Sport, best selection of hunting, hiking, fishing, camping gear on the mountain, go to Honda Skin Outdoor Sport south of Pine Top on Highway 260. Deemer's Glass, our glass man of the game. Wes and if you don't mind trying to keep track of rebounds or maybe who's Absolutely. battling the boards, find ourselves the glass man of the game, Deemer's Glass. If you need home for your need glass for your home or business, find Deemer's Glass, hands down best place to fall. Quality glass at affordable prices. Deemer's Glass, one triple eight glass man. That's Deemer's Glass, glass man of the game. And our Beeler Orthodontic straight line play of the game. Live, smile, love your smile. Beeler Orthodontics. I assume we're going to see at least one dunk in this game. Yuma Catholic has a few boys, I would say, that are pushing the 6-2, 6-3 mark. One minute left here until we start up the third period. Let's talk about our ace hardware keys to the second half. Weston, Yuma Catholic, what do they need to keep doing? You know, honestly, they need to keep moving the ball like they have been. They've been well on moving the ball around and getting it inside and being able to bring it to the rack and convert on their points. Um, it's definitely something that takes control of the game and they're just knowing what they need to do and how to do it and they work well together. It'd be a tough feat, call it the comeback of the millennia if <laughs> Ashford could come back and wins this game. But what does Ashford need to do for the second half lesson? They really need to take care, take control of the ball. They cannot, it seems like they can't, they just can't control the ball. They're yeah. just playing loose and not being able to find an open man and make their shots. Well, Ashford will Control possession to start the third period, and we are underway. Ash Fork with possession. Iola picks up his dribble right about half court and tries to find the open man. That's a turnover. Here comes the fast break. Nice dish there. 23. Eric finds the cutting Conley for two points. 47-44. 4 down. Ash Fork with the ball in the corner. Little turnaround jumper. No good. Stays black ball. Ash Fork with the ball. A shot was blocked. No good. Nope. Apparently they're calling travel. I oh thought wow. if the dude puts his hand on it, you're allowed to come back down with the ball. Is that not uh, how it works? No, it's not true. All right. Well, that's how much I know about this. <laughs> Turnover for Ash Fork. Yuma Catholic with the ball. Top of the key. That's Poe. Poe over to Conley. Conley up top to Logan. Logan over here to Poe in the left elbow. Poe to Earth. Earth. To Stanley, Stanley to Poe, Poe to the rim, two points. Beautiful ball movement by Yuma. Great ball movement by Yuma. Absolutely. Ashford finds the open cutter, that's Keel, and hey. there we go. There we go, Ashford with another two points. That was amazing, great ball movement on their part. 49 to six. Don't call it a comeback, folks. <laughs> Over here at the uh, elbow, back up to the top. 
Yuma Catholic will reset. Poe has it in the corner. Up to Earth. Earth over to Conley. Shot won't go. Offensive rebound tipped out to Earth. Earth finds Logan for three. No good. And rebound will be it'll be uh, out of bounds on Yuma Catholic. Ash Fork ball. Why don't you take over the play-by-play, -play, big guy? You want to try it? Absolutely. That's fine by me. Try it out, Wesley. Yeah. All right, here we go. All right, so Ash Fork's bringing up the ball. we got number 34, Aola. 24 brings it in. Goes up for the shot. No good. we got a foul, though. Looks but like it's going to be white, number four, Poe. Going to the line to the Mountain Mobile Autoglass free throw line, number 24, Keel. Keel, that's an interesting name. Up for the first one, and it is a make. Nothing but the bottom of the net. I love that sound. Right? It's just amazing. Since Jill's down my back. That's what, <laughs> that's what it sounds like when I shoot the ball. <laughs> Second shot's up, and it's good. Give me Catholic bringing it up. Back over to the side. Looking to get it inside. Out to the wing. Pulls it inside. Back up to the top. Oh, almost a turnover. Out to the corner. Back up to the top. Number 10 brings it in. Drives in with the three. And it is. Oh, I'm sorry. Not a long a three. two, yeah. It was a long two. Number 23. It's our boy Earth. Yes. Ashwork bringing up the ball. Oh, picked his dribble. Trying to find a man. Number 34 driving in. Oh, we're going to have a travel. I'm not very good at this. <laughs> it's tough. I'll take that over. It is. Over. Yeah, go for it, man. You're great, big guy. Thank you. Appreciate it. I've never been good with the name, so it's always hard to. Yeah, I don't know the name. <laughs> Chris Bennett in the house. Yes, sir. Yuma Catholic leads the contest 51-8. to eight. <laughs> Yuma Catholic almost turns the ball over. <laughs> Drive in here by uh, Conley. Shot won't go. Rebound down to Ashford. Keel with possession. Over to Iola. Ola right-handed dribble. Top key picks up his dribble and then throws the ball right into the defender's hand. Dunk the ball. Dunk it. Dunk it. Dunk it. No, he nice wanted to dunk it. By Earth. He wanted to dunk it, but was able to convert the two points. You see the replay here. Tongue in the cheek and everything. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Fifty-three to eight is your score. Four forty-six remaining here in the third period. Keel has it. Top of the key, searching for an open man. Can't find one. Pump fake. Almost throws it away. Ash Fork remains in possession. Down low to. Our boy Martinez, turnaround jumper won't go. Rebound down to Yuma Catholic. This is Poe. Poe, over to the elbow. That's Logan. Logan looking back over to Conley, top of the key, back over to Logan for three. Money in the bank. Yes, sir. It's a beautiful shot. I don't like the money in the bank. I, I, I got to come up with something better. How about cash money? Cash money? Yeah. I'll try cash money. All right. <laughs> Ashfork with possession now. Almost throws the ball away. That ball's out on Yuma Catholic. It'll stay Ashfork ball. Number 15 checking into the game for Ashfork. That is Iola. He replaces number 12, Beeson. Ashfork inbounds. That goes to Iola. And then he finds Iola. Two Iolas on the game. Keel. Kill, puts up a uh, jumper. He has it blocked in his face. Gets his own rebound, though. Tries to go baseline. Gets the ball poked away right into the defender's arms. And here comes Yuma Catholic on fast break. Poe, down to Earth. Earth, little uh, six-footer. Got it. Got it. That was a beautiful job. Might have been a little farther than six feet. Maybe. Call it a ten-footer. That's six points in the third quarter for Earth. I apologize to his family if I'm mispronouncing his name. Here he comes again. Don't get Oh, he was looking Come for on, man. <laughs> 60 to 8 is your score now. Hey, tell him to dunk it. <laughs> Great example of being in the right place at the right time. 3.02 remaining here in the third. This is Keel. He has the top of the key. He finds Iola. Iola over to the right elbow. Down to the baseline. Tries to dribble through some defenders. Has the ball knocked away. Maintains possession. Gets it up to number 15, Iola. There's a foul. Loose ball foul. It's going to be on Ashfork. You know, those honestly right there, those kind of fouls really kill you. You really got to be paying attention to what you're doing and not messing up the plays. 60 to 8 is your score. 2.46 remaining here in the third period. Ooh, Logan thought about the three, decides to drive. He's going to be fouled on the drive. Looks like a hard hit. 
it a shooting foul? It is not no, a shooting it's on the ground. foul. It's on the ground. Inbounding is number one, Hunt. Slaps it, gets the play going. Up top. He That's wanted Perbius. that three. Over to Logan. Logan looking down, back over to Pervious, top of the key. He lines up a three-pointer off the front iron. Up to rebound, Stanley. Stanley put back out. Successful, but he gets fouled. He'll go to the Mount Mobile Autogress free throw line. Check out this replay here, the offensive rebound here. Catches it, keeps the ball high, turns around, gets the foul. Just yep. like your top. Absolutely. You know, just like that, that right there is why, you know, Ashford is not doing so well. They're not boxing out, and honestly, that really helps convert plays into points. Stanley misses his first of two. His second Mount Mobile Autoglass free throw is up, and it is good. You know, he looks a lot like Mason Burgess from Blue Ridge a couple years back. You know what's funny? Dylan Smith said the exact same thing. Did he really? No, he didn't. No? He said that, not, never mind, never mind. Okay. He made reference <laughs> to another guy looking like Mason, but it wasn't oh, okay. that guy. Apparently everybody looks like Mason. Here's a three-pointer <laughs> bash fork. Ooh. That's off the top of the backboard. That'll be a, a uh, out of bounds. Yuma Catholic ball. Close one here, 60 to eight. 61 to eight. 207 remaining here in the third period. Don't go anywhere, anything can happen. I gotta give it to Ashford though. They're playing hard. They are, they absolutely they are. Here's a three pointer. Cash money. Cash money. I like cash money, that's not bad. Absolutely. Pervious gets his first points of the game. Kind of rolls Mine off the it, tongue. Lick it, stick it, nail it. <laughs> this is Kiel setting up the play. He'll go right handed drive, little 16 footer, no good. Battle for the offensive board. It'll stay black ball. How far is the free throw line from the hoop? The free throw line is not, not free throw, three point line. The three point line, I think it's 21. Yeah, no idea. Yeah. 22, I do, but it's you're far. A, you're a basketball coach. <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you think I should know those things? Three pointer from the corner, that's short. Rebound to you and Catholic to push up quickly. Dunk it, dunk it, dunk it, dunk it, dunk it. Oh! Wow. Kill comes in hard, blocks it hard. That's probably a little bit too much light. I think he got all ball. I think it's the body that had the foul. Here's the replay of it. Oh. I think it's a clean block. I think the foul's on the body. Absolutely. Probably pretty uh, upset from the air ball previous. More than likely. Yeah. Blake Murchison in the house. Pervious, his first Mount Mobile Autoglass free throw is up and in. 65 to 8, 114 remaining here in the third period. Frustration is definitely a thing that comes back and bites you in the butt. It's something that you got to be able to keep under control. When you make a mistake, you got to come back and make the next play. Previous makes both. 66 to 8. If Human Catholic doesn't actually hit 100 points, then did they actually win the game? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Here's a turnover by Ashford. Here comes Human Catholic, and he'll pull it out. They'll run the clock. Smart. Oh, behind the back dribble, smooth. Pervious lines up another three. That one's long. Rebound will be, no rebound, we'll have a loose ball foul on Yuma Catholic. Oh, that was out of bounds. Oh, was out of bounds, yep. that happened? Oh, never yeah. mind, I have, no <laughs> I have no idea what I'm talking about. 66 to eight, 47 seconds remaining here in the third period. And that's a turnover. Hunt brings the ball up for Yuma Catholic, top of the key. He'll stop, find an open man, that's Logan. Logan looks down low, drives, dishes to Stanley. Stanley in a little trouble handling the pass. Good move inside. Oh, they're oh. going to call travel. Wow. That was a beautiful move by 21, but. But you're only allowed two steps in this thing. Absolutely. In any league. <laughs> 66 to 8, 20 seconds remaining here in the third period. All I want in life is to see someone dunk the ball. It'll happen. Ashford looking for the open man. Get it. Yeah, yeah, I can't see what happened. We have a uh, out of bounds. Yep. Stays Ashford ball. Five seconds left here in the third period. For three. Nope. Rebound, battle four. Long rebound, dunk it. No. Oh. He, was <laughs> he was definitely looking for that dunk. He's going for it. All right, that'll do it for the third quarter. We'll step away. This is Shola Ford's presentation of High School Basketball right here on italk67.com. Who sells the number one truck in America? Sholo Ford. That's right, not only do they sell it, 
Solo Ford is the best place to buy it. Why? Guy Hatch guarantees it. In fact, he guarantees you'll get the best deal on your next Ford car, van, or SUV as well. It doesn't matter what you buy. Solo Ford has the best deal. Solo Ford on the east end of the Deuce and at SoloFord.com. Well, here we go. We're about to start the fourth quarter. Got ourselves a nail biter. It's Human Catholic 66, Ashbork 8. Let's check out our scoring on that third quarter. Conley with two, Poe with two, Logan with three points, Earth with eight points, and Pervious with four. That, leads, that brings Earth's point total to 14. Five for Logan, 11 for Poe. And uh, that pretty much catches everybody up. Earth leading all scorers with 14 points. He's our on the outdoor skiing sports store player of the game thus far. You been watching for those rebounds there, Big Absolutely. No, abs absolutely, I am. You and Catholic with the ball, passing around the perimeter, trying to find open man down low. Won't find him. Being patient, though. Patient basketball here by Human Catholic. Running their offense. Oh, good pass down low. Won't go. But offensive rebound. Back out to the top. Kid, it's a three. Cash money. Call it. That was a great shot by number three. Great ball movement and patient on the Human Catholic side. Conley with the deep tray. Ashport, long two. Hey, there we hey. go. All right. Beeson with two points. Oh, boy. It's a great shot. 69 to 10. Well contested for sure. So you're telling me there's a chance. <laughs> Good ball, man. I like, I like the way you, you got the, the patient with the ball. Very patient. Run their offense. Here's another three-pointer. Short, offensive board. Interesting, though, that they're still putting up three-pointers being up 69 to 10. That's interesting. Isn't that? that oh. Like in the baseball sense, that's like stealing third being up by nine. Yeah. Just doesn't make any sense. Another offensive oh. board. Put back, won't go. Battle for the board. Another, like, three offensive boards here in this one possession. Over the elbow, that's Mullen. Down low, good pass. Great pass down low. Good vision. Stover. That was a great look. And well to See on the replay there, great vision by Mullen. Absolutely, great execution. There's a turnover. Dunk it, big uh -oh. guy. Dunk it, big guy. Dunk it, big guy. <laughs> was that layup? Yes, sir. For who? That was number for number 24. 24. Beautiful layup. Ashford here, backing down, backing down off the glass, won't go. Offensive board, and he'll be fouled. Looks like uh, Newman Catholic is going to sub out their entire lineup. Stanley for Newman Catholic being nominated right now. Let's just give it to him. Absolutely. Stanley right now gets our Deemer's Glass, Glass Man of the Game. Congratulations, he's had multiple boards. This whole game. 14 to be exact. 14 boards to be exact, even though you haven't been actually been counting. I really have, though. <laughs> Deemer's Glass, if you need glass for your home or business, call Deemer's Glass. They're hands down the best place for glass. Great glass at affordable prices. Deemer's Glass, one AAA glass man. Congratulations to Stanley, our Deemer's Glass, glass man of the game. 73 to 10 here, Unit Catholic with the ball. Looking down low, can't find someone. In the corner to Logan, Logan to Earth. Offensive board to Stanley. There's our boy, yeah, Earth again. That one will go. That's shot by number 23, Earth. That's 16 points for him. Very impressive on the offensive side by Earth. Earth. <laughs> Ashfork now with the ball. Driving, driving, driving. Doesn't know how to use left hand. Bounces off the defender's knee. People laying on the board. We have a timeout. Timeout, black. We'll take one with him. This is the fourth presentation of high school basketball right here on italk1067.com. Who sells the number one truck in America? Sholo Ford. That's right, not only do they sell it, Sholo Ford is the best place to buy it. Why? Guy Hatch guarantees it. In fact, he guarantees you'll get the best deal on your next Ford car, van, or SUV as well. It doesn't matter what you buy. Sholo Ford has the best deal. Sholo Ford on the east end of the Deuce and at SholoFord.com. That's the wrong graphic. <laughs> nice job, whoever. Is that Chris Bennett? Up. <laughs> 75 to 10 is your score. 425 remaining here in the fourth. Ashfork ball. Inbound, long inbound. Iola at the free throw strike. Tries to drive between defenders, gets through. Ooh. Shot won't go. Rebound down to Yuma Catholic. It's great defensive side on the Yuma, not letting him in and 
Locking it down. Yuma Catholic on the elbow. Oh, great feed, great. Beautiful. Great look, Earth to Stanley. It was a great cut by Stanley, well executed and be able to put the points on the board. Now Ash Fork from the elbow. Shoot it, just shoot it. Beeson with the shot, that won't go. Rebound, Poe. Poe. Poe, <laughs> formerly known as Poo from the beginning of the game. <laughs> Logan now finds Conley. Conley to Poe in the corner. The low block to Stanley, great vision, turn around. Oh, oh man, couldn't offensive connect. board gets the put back. A great job in your own rebound and putting it right back That's up. 18 points for Earth. That's what basketball is all about, right there. My stats are not necessarily correct, though. They're pretty close. close 250, 259 remaining here in this contest. Ash Fork trailing, barely. I want to see 100 points. That's a rare feat in high it, school. It very is in high school basketball. You don't usually see baseline. Got it. Got a boy. That was a great drive right there by 34. Iola. Iola getting it done. 79 to 12. Stanley with the drive. Back up to Poe. Over to Conley. Off the glass. Rebound. Nope, we're going to have a foul. Over the back foul. It'll be Ash Fork ball. 219 remaining here in the contest. Got to make sure everything's correct. Got to follow the rules, bro. Yep. That's how it works. Hunt checking into the game. Taking a seat is Kyle Logan. 151 remaining in the game. 151, bum. You know that song? <laughs> yes, sir, I do. It's a turnover. Heading back the other way. 141 remaining. Clock is rolling. Got to give it to Ash Fork. You know, they're really, even though they're losing by a lot, they're still trying to give everything they got. I'm going to give our Honda Skin Outdoor Sport player of the game. I'm going to give it to Earth right now. He's sitting at 18 points. Congratulations to Earth. Totally mispronouncing, mispronouncing his name. Shoot it. Nail it. Uh, cross court pass between the fingers. Outdoor, Honda Outdoor Skiing Sports Store player of the game. Congratulations. For the best hiking, hunting, fishing, camping gear on the mountain, go to Honda Outdoor Skiing Sports Store. It's up the Pine Top on Highway 260. Our Bela Orthodontics, Live to Smile, Love to Smile, straight line play of the game. We'll give it to the whole team. Absolutely. Of Yuma Catholic scoring so far 79 points in this contest, the highest scoring I've seen on the day. 57 seconds left. Still waiting for a dunk. It'll come. Congratulations it's to the entire Yuma Catholic team winning our Live to Smile, Love to Smile, Be the Orthodontic straight line play of the game. Stanley, a little 10 footer, won't go. Offensive rebound down to Poe. Poe brings it out. He'll find Hunt on the three point line. Wanted it. Traveled. I didn't see the travel. He Apparently sure did. he did. You thought he traveled? Yes, he did. I didn't think so. Well, that's why I'm sitting here. 38 seconds left in the contest, 79 to 12. Want to thank North and Pioneer College. Want to thank Ace Hardware and Summit Healthcare Regional Medical Center. 30 seconds left in the contest. From the corner for three. It's long. No good. Dunk it. Go, Poe. Dunk it. Poe brings it up, and he will slow it down. He'll pull it back. Out. They'll just run the clock out here. Somebody dunk it. Throw an alley-oop. <laughs> 14, 13, 12. Congratulations, Yuma Catholic. They're going to win this contest 79 to 12. Got to give it to Ashford. Absolutely. It. Only seven guys on their roster. They never gave up, played hard. Yuma Catholic's a good team. Good, tall, strong team. That'll do it. 79 to 12 is your final. Yuma Catholic over Ash Fork. We will step aside until our next game coming up in about 15 minutes, which is Blue Ridge and Fort Thomas. Blue Ridge versus Fort Thomas. Congratulations, Yuma Catholic. We'll step away to Shola Ford's presentation of high school basketball right here on iTalk167.com. This has been Sholo Ford's presentation of high school basketball on iTalk 1067 KNKI Pine Top and iTalk1067.com. Brought to you in part by Northland Pioneer College, Ace Hardware of the White Mountains, Honda Ski and Outdoor Sport, Deemer's Glass, Beeler Orthodontics, Summit Regional Medical Center, Octopus Car Wash, Mountain Mobile Auto Glass, and Little Bluebird Studios. This broadcast is a copyrighted production of iTalk 1067 and Country Mountain Airwaves, a open key communications station. Any rebroadcast, retransmission, or use of this broadcast without the expressed written consent of iTalk 1067 or Country Mountain Airwaves is strictly prohibited. For more information on this game and other games around the region, go to iTalk1067.com.
Robinson, we all call him J-Rob. He's Where? a teacher. He's right here in a blue shirt. Oh.